All right, and we're and we're live. We're live. We're hot. We're ready to go. I do that. I do that all the time. Yeah. It's like when you're really full, you just like you lean back. Oh. Oh God. Oh. Yeah. Yep. Constantly. Usually after lunch, right before my nap, is when I when I like to do. You know I love. But the guys with the real, you know, see the camera, real big belly, you know. Yeah. They just. Yeah, just up on top. I can't wait till I, till I get my big belly, dude. I'm gonna rest my gear on there. Oh yeah, there. dude. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's right there. It's perfect. What no. kind of sissy drink are you drinking? I've got really massive hands, actually. This is a yeah, is that is what it is? Normal size? Yeah, this is a double deucer, dude. Actually, is that why your penis always looks so small? <laughs> <laughs> no, this is one of those. I mean, I don't know if I can show product, but it's one of those double shots. If you guys know. Oh. See, I I mean I appreciated a lot of a lot of caffeine, but they're fucking so expensive, man. They are expensive. No reason for a little drink like that to be that expensive. Yeah, yeah they're expensive. It's nice being rich as fuck for sure, but <laughs> dumb loaded, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that is a complete lie. Uh all right. Let's uh let's get right to it. Fact and opinion for a Friday. Um well, I mean, should we should we do fact and opinion? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. I don't know if there's anything else you want to talk about. So, uh, okay, fact and opinion. Here we go. Humans are the only animals that can blush, and perhaps the only species that can feel embarrassment. Blushing appears to be a unique human expression, which happens when blood vessels in the face dilate when we're embarrassed. Wow, humans are crazy. They're incredible, credible creatures. But you know what? I think we. I think we. Uh... Well, underestimate, you know what, you know what weird thing is, right? And I brought this up to you before besides humans, what other animals or living things laugh like legit laugh? I mean, I'm sure there's documented cases of it, you know, of animals, but on a reg, like, like finding shit funny. I don't know. You're right. Finding it funny. So like, like the human being, uh, Finding something funny is it's always like a twist in the brain or something where it's like unexpected. Something happens where you, something in your brain is like, oh, ha, ah, that's funny. Yeah. You know, it's weird. It's a weird emotion that I thought about one time. And I was like, is there any like like monkeys? They're laughing. I've seen a monkey laugh, but yeah. they're laughing because something's funny necessarily. I mean, I guess people falling down can be funny to something. It doesn't I mean, have to be in really intelligent, I guess, but uh, here, it's a weird thought. You know, what's crazy is so you bring this up. Um, uh, I have this awesome video the other day and Riley, my, my daughter, she's uh, just about three months old and uh, she's starting to laugh. Mm -hmm. And just the other day, it's the first time she's done it. We've seen her do it. She was reacting to something that uh, Kiki was doing. My wife oh, was right. doing. And so, like, so somebody we're just saying her name. We're like Riley, and she, ah, ha, ha, ha. and so it wasn't just she was just laughing nonstop. She would laugh, and then we do it again. So she was reacting she, to. She, she was waiting for the cue, right? Like she was waiting for the cue, right. and it's so weird that you know our body naturally, when we're amused, when something uh, it tickles our fancy, uh, it makes us happy and joyful. Mm -hmm. We and laughing is also a thing i mean everyone laughs everyone laughs i don't know if you're taught to laugh it's just something we do because uh, here's the other thing too uh even uh even blind people if you're uh blind from birth you still smile you know right. your body naturally does that when you're happy right, right? which is right. weird the muscles in your face you just it's yeah. it's, it's an actually well yeah. even even my baby it's crazy like when, dude when she's sad she she frowns she you know, and I mean, like, that's just what her face naturally does. And it's weird that our bodies do that, you know. Mm -hmm. There's this other documentary I was watching. This is another kind of uh, in the same aspect of what you're talking about. Uh, a herd of elephants. They were going from point A to point B, which was like hundreds of miles, we'll say. Yeah. And the documentary crew followed this ele these elephants, but they went to they went like. 200 miles out of the way to their destination to go visit a memorial site of a previous elephant that had died. Weird. And so like this, this herd of elephants went to go like pay their respects yeah. to this yeah. elephant that has been dead for years. 
And they even like got down on their knees and like they had like a weird little ceremony. And then they kind of went on their way and went, went, continued to their destination. But just weird to think like, dude, that, that's an animal that has feelings and, and understand and knows where it's at. Yeah. And who, who, who fell and who passed and and, and very human like are are doing like a ceremonial thing for Mm -hmm. this. Mm -hmm. It just shows that like, just because we could talk and, and we can communicate and we think we, well, I mean, we are on top of the food chain. That's, that's, yeah, that's sure. a lie. But unless we're in the Serengeti without a weapon, without then a we're... weapon, then, then you, you might be in the yeah. middle somewhere. Yeah. Then yeah. Then, then, yeah find, a, find a tree. Actually, you're still fucked. You're still, you know? but it's just interesting to like, we think it's all oh, it's just a dog, you know, yeah. like, is it no. really just a dog though? Or is this dog really, really understanding and thinking about what's going on around him at all times? Like, my dog, he knows, like, if I say bear, you know, and I, I use, right. you know, a little bass in my voice, his ears go down, his tail goes down. They know when they're in trouble. They know when they're getting a treat. They uh, have the vocal cords and and, and, and the mouse. They, they could they would talk, I think, yeah. you know. Well, which, and they do their own way. It's, it's what's so funny right. is we're like, oh, animals can't talk, but they talk in their own way. Yeah. Barks, bird chirps and songs and elephant uh, whales. Dude, I just read a fact that uh, I just read this literally on Reddit. Uh, sperm whales make a clicking <laughs> noises so loud. I know that's nice. Sperm whales, <laughs> jizz, uh, jizz fish. God, right? Why did you, it's the name you chose, huh? Uh, make a clicking noise so loud uh, it can be heard by other sperm whales all the way across the world, across the well, world. And these clicking noises, if, if animals or say a human was around it when it when it did it, it could kill you. It's really it's that, it's that impactful. Boom. Well, it's it. I, I'm pretty sure every whale's bellow is unique. I'm yeah. almost positive. Oh, every yeah. whale ever has a unique. Yeah. There's another weird study that came out about dolphins and in, in, in the way they're communicating. I, I, they talk for pleasure. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> That, it's just wild to think, man. You know, yeah. that's why. I, I, no, I know you don't like killing things. I, I, I can't. I, I think about it. Too much. To. Not me. Not me. I look I know, you're, <laughs> between the eyes, man. I, no, I think, but I, I think there, there's a respect with it. I think when we, us, instead of thinking that we're above everything else, just think we're, we're, we need to be copacetic. We need to live with and be a part of it because with everything, you know, and, and that's why I, like getting in the killing thing, like, I don't want to go out there and choke out a fucking deer and be like, ah, oh, fucking yeah, deer. Yeah, you're not, the pleasure isn't, you're not getting the pleasure from. No. No, it, the, I mean, the pleasure isn't in the hunt. Sick, I think. Twisted mother, bro. Yeah, yeah. I'm out there with a fucking stick of dynamite. You know what I mean? Like, oh. <laughs> uh, but but with any animal, you know, the 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 fox eats the rabbit, the rabbit sure. eats the, you know what I mean? Like, it's all, it's all what is? the circle of life. Ah, so when you're going to give me some pizza, bro. That's <laughs> my favorite one. Uh, anyway, so yeah, so how do we? What were the, what the fuck were we talking about? Oh, blushing, blushing. Oh yeah, uh, blushing. I'm sure there's got to be other animals that maybe get shy or embarrassed, but maybe right, blushing. The is like first, the, the first thing that comes to mind uh, when you blush the hardest in your life. Oh God. Where you just fucking stomach drop, dude, and you're just like, I don't want to be here. So oh. I, I get embarrassed pretty easily. I can fight past the embarrassment and do embarrassing things, right. but there's some cringy things that it ha- have happened. And it's not even like they're that bad. It's not right. even like they're that bad. Like one, I think about my cousin's wedding, uh, uh, Carson and Katie, uh, fantastic. And, uh, at, right before dinner started, my uncle Steve comes over and says, Hey Brock, I want you to do the prayer. And I was like, Oh, okay. That's fine. And I ended up going. Prayer's like, tough, dude. It's it's tough it's, to do it. It's my dad. My dad is amazing, but he's been Serious doing it. Thing. But, but here I am. I'm like, all right, I'm gonna do a great prayer. I go off on like this five minute thing, and then I forget what the fuck I'm doing. And then finally, <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, it was nice. What I said was nice, but instead of just saying, "Oh, what a beautiful day," you're the long winded <laughs> prayer guy because you feel like you got to make up. For you. Here's the worst part. And then at the end, when I realized, like, I'm on this fucking tangent, I think I kind of looked over at my wife, and she's like. Okay, wrap, yeah, wrap it up, it up dude. Like, wrap it up. Uh, uh, well, Here's now and, and now we're gonna go eat, and I'm just like, motherfucker. Here's the thing: with prayers, anybody watching this, with prayers, 
Everybody around you likes the short and sweet prayer. Yep. But yep. there's always the guy. They always ask the guy. My sister is the one in our family. So yep. she'll start the prayer, man. I'm telling you, 15 minutes later, dude, we're talking. She's yeah. she's she's into family members, like uh, and then my brother is the complete opposite. So my dad always asks who's gonna pray or who's gonna do so, especially around Christmas, like yeah. our fallen relatives will uh, do like a toast, you know. Yeah. And, well, there's, there's a good a good handful of, of relatives that have died, so there's a lot of toast going around. Yeah, yeah. So my dad, I was always assigned to the toast, like who's going to toast for Grammy, who's going to toast for Granddad, blah blah blah. Well, yeah. CJ, my brother, got asked, and he never gets asked. He's the youngest in the family, you know. He's not, he's shy. He's not that. But my dad was like, CJ, you're doing, you're doing so and so this year. You could see it, in my brother's face, dude. Like, no, I, but dude, I. I I don't I can't do this. I don't I don't know what to do. He like pulled me aside and, and I leaned into it. I'm like, I started videoing him. I'm like, all right, this is the beginning of CJ getting ready to do the prayer. He's like, dude, why are you video? You could see him start to sweat. I'm like, we're family, dude. It's fine. It's yeah. not like you're going on stage. Yeah. But yeah. Yeah. It's just it was funny because his was like, thank God, blah, 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 blah. That was it. My sister's is like 25 minutes long. Over the gums, through the lips, look out, stuff. Here we go. Let's go. Amen. Right. You know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But yeah, no, there's definitely things that, uh, not too many. It's more of like you're in the shower and you remember an argument that you should have won and you're like, fuck, man. That's it. Yeah. That's it. Not yeah. so much. My, mine, the where I blush the most, and this always comes to my brain first when this ever gets brought up, which it never gets brought up. But um, that one time, I've told you this before, I was in Walmart. My mom bought me one of those big, huge bouncy balls, right? Yeah, yeah. And I'm bouncing it up to the to the checkout to, you yeah. know, to pay for it. Bing, 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 kaboom, dude. It was like a nuke. That thing went off. It was it was tight, too, you know, packed to the air top, man. Boom. And I, it flashbanged me, dude. I remember coming out of it, swing, you know, just like a flashbang in, like, I remember because everything was white, just like a flashbang. And, you know, it came, you, you start seeing the circle come back. And everybody was looking. At, I was a kid, too. Yeah. Everybody was looking at me. And I'm like, I didn't know what happened. I don't know where I was. All I knew is, like, everybody was staring at me at this yeah. given moment. And I yeah, started look. crying. And I just turned red. And I ran out of the store. <laughs> Worst part was uh, Hunter was 17 years old. In the <laughs> I was. I was 24, dude. I was 24. I really was amazing. looking at me. Yeah, dude, as a kid, everything fucking embarrasses oh, you, man. man. Oh. Even some time, was, relatives you don't know, like know all that well. Like, oh. There was one time I got uh, like fifth grade. Sorry, no, we got to wrap this up. Right, no, you're good, you're good. Fifth grade, dude, my parents always dress me up in sweatpants suits or whatever. All solid color from JC yeah. Penny. You get green, red, Look gray. At <laughs> right. So I got pantsed in front of this girl I had a crush on in fifth grade. Yeah. And I had whitey tidies on, and she's like, "Oh, you're wearing whitey tidies." And dude, I remember I, it just deflated me. Yeah, Def I went home. I didn't want to go back to school. Yeah, uh, it'll ruin it. It'll ruin you it. Know, I'm like, mom, why are you dress me up in these pants that could easily be pulled? So down? easy. I need she a belt. I need a belt for God's sake. You know? I'm dead to put the pants on. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Just try not to think about it. And here's what they always say with embarrass embarrassing things nobody remembers you know that's that's the crazy thing only you or maybe one other person right. remembers but you yeah. know and you know what's funny is like the older i get the less embarrassed i, I really i really don't give a well, shit and I mean, also, I, don't, I don't really give a shit but there's also i'm not as getting into you know i really don't if right, I, there's if, less things you hear yeah Especially if it's for a good cause, like, oh, we're going to put you in a dress and put you on, say, fucking fine. All right. Wh whatever. Who gives you know, a if shit? You're going to laugh at it. Hey. Yeah. yeah. You know, if it's for a good cause or whatever, I don't, I don't care. So, yeah. It's because there's twofold. I mean, you don't want to make a complete ass out of yourself all the time. But if you're that guy, like, no, nope, not doing it. No, not, not going to do it. No, 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 no. Let's, no. It's like, come on now. You're a real fucking wet blanket. Get out of here. Real quick. Yeah. Last example. All right. This might actually top them all. Yeah. When I, I stole a uh, basketball senior year, right? Going down pack gym. It's a rival game. This the past week I was dunking in practice a lot. I, I, I had some I had some hops in high school, bro. Kind of. Yeah. Yeah. And everybody knew They're like, hey, this guy's dunking. He might be able to dunk in the game. Dude, break away. Nobody around. And I tripped over my own feet. Oh, yeah. Literally scorpion, yeah. dude. Scorpion yeah. feet over the head. Oh. Made the noise. <laughs> dude. You know what, though? Here's why the embarrassing part, it, it almost was better. 
I think there was a better reaction from me falling on my face than if I were to actually go up and dunk it. You know what's what's what actually you know? for society it's better that that happened because you would have been so fucking cocky after that. Like, <laughs> okay. See that chunk? Yeah, I'm just gonna whip my dick out right now for oh, everybody. So, for real, especially yeah. back then, man. Ooh. I was, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, oh, it's, hormones. It's better that you went. Eek. Actually, Yo. I got a very similar one, and, and to 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 kind of uh, echo that right. same thing happened. Uh, Kiki. I used to play a, uh, a a slow pitch league, you know, a, a, a softball league. She'd do it with her friends. She's been doing it with a group of friends for years. Well, I'd always just go and watch when we were dating and everything because I never played baseball. I'm not a baseball guy. So I'd just go and drink beer and watch while they did this. It was a good time. Well, one time, one of their players couldn't make it. They're like, Brock, can you fill in? Oh, boy. Dude, fuck it. I should have said no. I said, sorry. I just I can't do it. So I can hit a ball fine. So I, I'm up to bat. I hit the ball. I go running for first while I'm wearing longer pants. I'm fucking chugging away. Dude, pants get caught up. Off. Dude, it looks like I – it's like – I know you just got to run through. Just You're run doing through. the thing, trying to, like, keep your dude, pants I, up. Dude, didn't fall, but, like, you fucking wiped out hard. Oh, so yeah. with my With my girlfriend trying to impress her friends as – and I'm a fairly athletic guy, right? right, I'm right. Like, Fuck, man. Dude, it's then, Especially, like, that, that scenario, too, because – both you and I aren't baseball players. No, no. You know? and I mean, then you're going to be that guy who goes, well, look, I don't play baseball. I don't play. Like, right, yeah, so you can't say anything. No, no. Here's what I always do. I've only played softball a few, few times. Wait, hold on. Why not right field? I think that's like they're the worst. Position. That's what I was going to add. Then they also put me in the outfield. I swear to God, every ball was hit towards me. Oh, I'm yeah. like, who do I throw it to? I don't know. Do exactly what I, I'm always it's asking so the guy fun. next to me. I'm like, hey, yeah. right now in this scenario – my chance if I catch this ball, what do I do? Yeah. What, what should yeah. I do with it? Yeah. And dude, yeah. it was so fucking embarrassing because, dude, I played college football. Like, I'm an athletic guy, yeah. but I look like such a fucking chump. I'm like, oh, God, it's yeah. softball. It's beer league softball. And here yeah, I am. Seeing it up with you, you embarrassing yeah. fool. Oh, so. yeah. Yeah. I whip my dick out at the end of that. <laughs> God. Oh, man. Anyway, so, all right. Well, this went way longer than I thought it was, but uh, good, embarrassing yeah. stories. I like it. I like yeah. it. Well, that's going to do it for Brock and Hunter here uh, on the After Show podcast. We will see you next time for a, another fact and opinion and uh, more embarrassing stories, probably. All right, we'll see you later.